Before performing any type of system maintenance, you should always test your tools and equipment that you will be using on the job site. Testing your tools is essential to fast and reliable service of an AC system. The purpose of testing is to ensure that there are no leaks within your tools themselves. This could lead to false assumptions that the leak is coming from the system, which could lead to searching for a system leak that actually isn't there, costing you time and money. Start by testing your vacuum gauge, as you will need a properly working vacuum gauge to test your other tools. Replacing your gauge's oil catch filter is routine maintenance that will keep your gauge clean and reading accurately. As we evacuate systems, residual oil can build up in the filter and eventually reach the sensor. This may cause unnecessary stalling and possibly give you a false reading. Further cleaning of the sensor is only necessary if your gauge is acting erratically. We want to always perform a bench test on our vacuum pump to ensure it is pulling a deep vacuum. Before starting the bench test, be sure to check the cap gaskets. Cap gaskets are often damaged or misplaced from repeated use. It's important to note the vacuum pump's oil condition during the bench test. If you notice discoloration of the oil along with slow performance, it may be time to perform an oil flush procedure. This will help remove contaminants that may be in the pump from previous evacuations. Starting an evacuation with clean oil in your vacuum pump is key to a fast and efficient evacuation. If your vacuum pump is pulling a deep vacuum, it's time to test the evacuation hoses. With the day-to-day -day connecting and pressure swings, hose gaskets will lose their integrity over time. Check for nicks and damage to the gasket. Check that all the hose gaskets are accounted for and fully seated. If a gasket isn't properly seated, use the blunt end of a ballpoint pen to fully seat it. Along with the hose gaskets, the gaskets in all angled fittings and connectors should be examined prior to servicing a system. Valve core removal tools are common points of wear from repeated connecting, disconnecting, pressure swings, and refrigerant exposure, so the gaskets and seals can become worn and damaged. We always recommend performing an isolation test. This test will ensure that all the internal O-rings and ball valve seals are holding a vacuum properly. A list of step-by-step -step videos on these tests for Appian equipment can be found in the description below. Most of the concepts covered in these videos do apply to any manufacturer's tools, but in some cases might not have the same features as Appian's equivalent. Now that your tools are proven to be in working order, we will learn the importance of clean vacuum pump oil and proper oil management.